Hey guys, Seb here, bringing you back another video. Now today I'm going to be showing you how to install the mine and the mine and battle gear mod. It's a very fun mod. I've used it and it's really good. Now the firstly, you're going to want to go to your Minecraft and force the update by doing this. Right loads. So you're going to want to go options force update and let your minecraft update while you do that check the description there will be a link to the mine and battle gear actual mod um, thing and you're going to want to download minecraft forge here and you're going to want to download the um, render player api which is here and then the render ap which will be here I'll have a link to all of these in the description. I recommend downloading them via AdFly, but it's your decision really. So yeah, link for all those will be in the description. Check those out. And also there is a texture pack for this mod, which is a bit further down the page here. Click that and it will download it. Just go and drop that into your texture pack folder. I'll show you how to do that in a minute. So once you've downloaded everything, you will have four folders like this. And now after you, and you'll have to just make sure your Minecraft has it fully updated, like mine has. And then you're going to want to open up your computer, type in percent app data percent, and hit enter. Go to your dot Minecraft, your bin, and then your Minecraft executable jar, jar file. You're then going to want to right click, open with WinRAR Archiver. This is where WinRAR comes in. It's a archiver which unzips files for you. It's free, so I would recommend downloading it. And now when the .jar actually comes up, first thing you're going to want to do is go ahead and delete your meta inf. So that will mess up all your mods. Now the first file you need to put in your .jar is the forge client. So have that next to your thing and just get all the files, drag them in. Click OK. close that down. Now you're going to want the render packages. Um, oh, drag them, put them in. Click OK. Now you're going to want the other play IP. Get all those files. Drag them in. Click OK. And then you're going to want the mine and back the actual mod itself. Get everything off there and drag it in and click OK. And then you're practically done I believe. So close down that. Open up your Minecraft and you are good to go once you log in. Now um, I've got one of my friends of Skype here, um, Joe, if you, if you want to say hello to YouTube. Hello YouTube. Yeah he will tell you how cool this mod is. And then here's one of the simple crafting recipes, a mace here, a diamond mace, here we go. It's a pretty nice weapon, I'll just show you it here. Yeah, I will be doing a mod review for this later, so keep an eye out for that. Yeah, and thanks for watching, so it's me signing off. Joe, if you want to say goodbye. Yeah, so thanks for watching. Again, please rate, comment, and subscribe. So yeah, see you next time. Bye.